Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to NIMBY Rails. Now, uh, this time around, I'm continuing the uh, rail expansion project here in the south of Alberta. Uh, last time around, roughed in uh, the uh, line from um, over here toward uh, Crow's Nest Pass. And uh, yeah, that's... Uh, that's got uh, a little bit more to go here to uh, to plumb that in. And also from Lethbridge to Medicine Hat and on to Walsh, which is roughly where the, uh, the um, Saskatchewan border is. And then possibly um, a run a line from through... Um, uh, Lake Louise, down through Banff, Canmore, through Calgary, and out toward Medicine Hat as well. Um, so I'm not going to bore you with the actual building because, uh, well, I am, but not uh, in real time. Because that's going to take a month of uh, yesterday's, tomorrow's, Sunday's, and everything else you can add in there. So I thought I'd treat you to a bit of a speed build. Now, I'm not sure if I'm going to just um, do a, uh, uh, a uh, comical uh, speed, up, speed run here where you, I just speed up the footage or if I'm going to do some sort of montage or something. Depends how lazy I get when I edit. But yeah, so, uh, so I guess uh, editing me, take it away. Okay, that's got us uh, the line across from uh, Crow's Nest Pass over to Medicine Hat. So that's um, quite a uh, quite a batch of uh, tracks to be uh, planned, isn't it? Now it occurs to me I could speed up the uh, the uh, clock here and well just get some things done slightly. Um, uh, faster, right? But now, uh, from uh, Medicine Hat, uh, ultimately, uh, I need to build the uh, east-west uh, uh, operation here. So now, I need to uh, plunk in some more um, stations, right? And uh, doing that, I'm definitely going to put one over here at Walsh. Um, and I think probably here. Yeah, there. Uh, and we'll do that on that angle. Yep. And we'll come back here. Do I need one at Irvine? I'm going to put one at Irvine or Irving. Um, uh, we're going to stash it here, right? And um, Dunmore looks like it could do with one as well. So I'll uh, stick one here. Right, okay. And we're going to need to, well, then uh, the train line just needs to come out of, um, uh, out of Medicine Hat and come along that way. Now the east-west one, um, I'm going to put also one, it's going to keep going this way. So we'll, we'll put one at Red Cliff. 
Um, no, do we, where do, I think we probably want to put it in the middle of the town a little closer anyway. So can we get one in here? Um, that doesn't conflict, really? You can build a station over a road? Um, okay, I'll take it. So we'll, we'll build that in there. Uh, what's the catchment on it? 458. Yeah, that's not too terrible. Um, now, Suffield. I think we probably want one at Suffield. Um, probably. Yep, there. Um, right. And then we come up along the, the highway here. Um, we won't put one at Tilly, I don't think, but we'll put one at Brooks. Brooks is big enough that maybe we should put it in the middle of the town. Yeah, we should probably put it in the middle of the town. How about right here? Uh, that gets us 829 catchment. So we got Brooks. Uh, we keep coming up here. And we've got what? Bassano, yeah, Bassano, we should put one in. Um, where? Uh, right about here, I think. Why there? Just because. Oh, just because, huh? Yeah, just because. I'm not familiar with these towns out here, uh, particularly, so, uh, I'm not going to obviously be putting things in the obviously best place. Yeah. Uh, Gleeson probably. Um, put it here. Uh, that's the Siksika Nation Tribal Administration, apparently. Yeah. We'll, we'll stick it there. Okay. And then uh, we come around... Yeah, definitely Strathmore. Uh, where in Strathmore, though? Yeah, that is the question, isn't it? Um, here? Yeah, 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 there's probably as good as anything. Right, so that's Strathmore. And then we definitely want Chestermere. Now, where are we going from Chestermere? Uh, we're probably going through Calgary. Uh, hmm. Probably Calgary City Hall will be going through. Okay. Well, in that case, uh, we probably want to come in this way. So... For Chestermere, I think that means we put the station right here. Um, right. And that gets us a decent catchment of 913. Yeah. Okay. And then we just need to come in this way. Now, um, I think maybe I want to put a station over here at Forest Lawn. So if I were to put one here, um, yeah, yeah, we'll put a station there on the way in. Uh, and then we'll come in here and we're going to need an underground. And it's going to go uh, here to here. Okay. We'll do that now. I need to move. No. I need to relocate this properly. Okay, so we'll line that up like that. 
and line this up like this. Uh, just like that, okay. And this one's too long on this end. Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll take that. Um, so that's going to be the connection point here. And then uh, we'll be paralleling this way. Oh no, we'll be coming out up toward this way. Um, uh, where would we stop on the way out here? Um, what if we st put a stop? Uh, right, we need a station thing. What if we put a stop here? Yeah. And then we'll definitely need one in Cochrane. The rail line goes through here in Cochrane. I'm thinking here. Yeah, there will probably do. Yep. And then, uh, Ghost Lake, do we want? No. Morley should have one, I think. Just because. Yeah, we want to get over the river. So if we put one in Morley, it doesn't have much catchment, but it's an excuse to go over the river, right? So, right, so we put one there, come along this way, and we are at um, uh, Lac des Arc. Uh, if we were to put, what, put it here for Lac des Arc, uh, we'd catch bits of Exshaw, but no. I think we'll put it over here by the road. Right here. Um, right. Good. Uh, Dead Man's Flats probably should get one, maybe. Because we have to come by anyway. Um, and we definitely need one in Canmore. Um, where in Canmore? Probably right about here. Right about here? Yeah, we'll put it right about here. Uh, okay. Yep, yeah, there. And then Harvey Heights, no. Uh, we definitely need one in Banff. Um, right. Where in Banff? Probably downtown Banff. Here? Yeah, probably. Okay. So if we put it there. Yeah. Yeah. Now, we also want to come out this way to Lake Louise. Uh, right. Okay. Can we fit it here? No. Um, we could fit it here, though. Uh, right here, right? So that gets us our uh, east-west uh, bit here up through Medicine Hat and to, the, uh, to the border with Saskatchewan. And I think that's going to be, that's going to be the critical point, I think. Um, I might, 
I might also want to put one from Edmonton down towards Saskatoon. Um, yeah, I might. Um, okay. Anyway, uh, what I'm going to do, uh, I'm going to uh, go away again. And we're going to uh, uh, do some sort of a montage Dewey or whatever to make a uh, uh, some rails. So uh, I'll be back in a bit. Editor me, take it away. Okay, I'm back after a whole bunch of uh, track laying here. Uh, we've got Lake Louise uh, through the uh, mountains here uh, into Banff where I've done this thing here, which is not ideal. Uh, and we've got all of this stuff along here. And we're into Cochrane. Now, uh, I'm actually going to take us into uh, the Calgary bit uh, live. Uh, you know, like on uh, at real time, uh, so just uh, you know, so we can see the uh, the thought process here. So I'm uh, coming along here uh, I'm to get out of the uh, the town area with as few collisions with roads as I I can arrange. Um, now I need to uh, take a look here. Uh, we need to get around this, uh, this is a golf course. Uh, we need to get around to this scenic acres thing here, uh, which uh, coming out of here, we're going to go up the middle of the, uh, the road there. Uh, there will be a second track along there, uh, ultimately, which is going to uh, uh, be the uh, local service. Uh, if I get around to extending that at least. Uh, so we get up around this way. Um, right. Now uh, we need to get through here somehow. Um, uh, what we're going to do, we need to get off the uh, road. So we'll uh, do some sort of a viaduct thing across here. Uh, and even across here, right? And we can come back down to ground level. And then I need to uh, get this basically across. Now, the thing is that uh, there's, a gr there's a park in here, right? Um, it's not on the map, but there's a big park in here. Uh, it's kind of a... Uh, it's actually an operating ranch, uh, and yeah, it's uh, it's something even a lot of the locals aren't uh, really aware of, uh, which is kind of good for the park, actually, if you think about it. Um, right. 
So that would be a, a bit of a challenge for uh, for putting a uh, a uh, high speed uh, rail link in along here, but that's not as big of a problem as it sounds, simply because there's already a rail line and a high speed line could parallel that. So that gets us into Calgary. Now we need to get out of the downtown on our uh, underground. Uh, you know, station here, and we need to kind of, uh, yeah, we need to get get across and up this way. Now, I think the way to do it is probably to come out this way, uh, some distance, and then we can bend our way up this way. Yeah, okay, so we can come out up that way. Um, we'll come out up this way. Uh, and I guess we can probably come along and parallel this line uh, somewhat. Yeah, uh, we're going to get some uh, slower uh, um, trackage here if I'm not careful. Um, slower trackage is not necessarily bad, um, just that it's, uh, a little bit, um, tedious. Uh, so we come along, we can parallel this. Uh, through here. Now this is expensive because we're going underground. Now I'm going underground here because the there really isn't a, an easy uh, way to put a decent track above ground here. Um, like these interchanges that it has to run through, they tend to cause uh, some level of uh, complication as well. Uh, really? Okay, no. Okay, we need a hotkey that prevents snapping. Uh, okay, now I can come up back up above ground here, um, like this, where I'll run in the middle of the uh, the road, right? Uh, while we uh, get up to the uh, line that's coming in. Uh, right. Okay, we uh, keep on going. Right. Okay. So, uh, while I'm doing this, I'm just going to mention the uh, future plans for NIMBY Rails. After I finish the, uh, the Alberta thing, uh, I'm going to uh, give NIMBY a break. Uh, and then I'll uh, I'll get on with another uh, another game. Now I'm not sure which one that's going to be exactly in this time slot, but I think it's probably going to be. Oh, what would it be? Maybe it'll be Austria. Yeah, I'm not uh, completely sure on that. So that gets us uh, all the way up up there and then we need to get out of the uh, city going east as well up to here uh, now we can be above ground for a fair chunk of that so let's go inbound this way um, well if we do this Nope. We can come along like this. Yeah, we can get past all of that business and that business and that business. 
all of this business all the way in. Now I'm pretty sure this would be a fairly extensive remodel of the whole uh, area to actually build this. Uh, and that's fine. Now here, I think we come out this way and then we go, I think we tunnel here. Right, I think we, we tunnel. Uh, yeah, yeah, this is a big mess. We got the river. Um, and we need to come up into the downtown. Um, right, okay. Okay, we can get in. Right. So we come out on this angle. Yeah, this is definitely not an ideal uh, setup, um, but we need uh, more flexible track laying to uh, to do anything particularly uh, impressive here. Uh, right, we're going to need a viaduct over the river, like that, okay. And we can come through the existing railway location here, right? Which will come down this way. And then we'll come around like this. Okay, so that gets us uh, eastward out. And then from here, I think we can go uh, like this, like this, then I think we can just, uh, we need to go, uh, yeah, we'll go up this way. Uh, why? Well, because it lets us get around all of this business up here. Right, um, and it lets us get across, and then, right, we need to get out of here. Uh, no. Okay, now if we come come across like this, yeah, I think we can. We can probably make this work. Um, I actually explicitly avoided the school there just because. Okay, now we can get, run across there. Okay, so uh, the rest of this is basically uh, connecting up uh, the stations down toward Medicine Hat and Walsh. Um, so um, I guess... Uh, well, let's uh, let's get stuck in on that, right? Uh, theoretically, this will be uh, easier-ish. Um, so if we come across like this, can we get... Yeah, we're going to need to viaduct over that, uh, right? There we go. And then across to here, right? And then uh, up to here. Okay, that gets us across. Yeah, there's a there's a causeway there, so that makes it relatively uh, straightforward. Now I think we want to just crow fly it um, through here. Yeah, I think we want to crow fly it through here. 
um, over to the uh, station in Strathmore, uh, which will come out on this this angle, I think. Yep. Okay. Now we can come across like that. Yeah. Whoops. And then we can just uh, crow flies it straight across there. Okay. So that saves following the, uh, the road. Now we need to come down to here and we can crow fly that to, uh, right. So we need to come down this way. Yeah. Across the, uh, the highway, get across the, uh, the road there. Huh? There's a motorsports park down there. Uh, who knew? Obviously the people that built it knew. Oh, you're, uh, you're you're being you're going to try to be clever are you yeah i figure why not now we need to get down to here uh we can come across like this like this yeah we can come down this way uh, and this way where is it okay we want to come across this way Okay, we come out here. Okay, now, and we need to cross there. Okay, so that gets to there. Now we need Bassano. Again, I think we can just uh, run this largely as the crow flies. Uh, out of the, uh, the town. Okay. Right. Right. Oh. I'm thinking that the uh, rail line must go somewhere along this uh, angle here in real life. Um, just because there's uh, a whole bunch of dead end roads there. Um, we come across this way, this way, this way, and across there. Okay. So it's a lot easier building these things across the uh, the middle of uh, nowhere. Now, what's next? Uh, Brooks. Yeah. So we uh, we just um, we just uh, bail our way out here. Uh, whoops. No. Come out this way, and then we can come down this way. Yeah. Okay. Now we kind of want to parallel the highway just because it's a landmark. Uh, we can come down this way, come down this way, come on. Uh, like that, yeah. Yeah, we can do that. See, the grid roads are uh, really annoying when you're trying to uh, do all of this business. Uh, yeah, okay. So if we come down here, right, we can come down this way. Yeah. Okay down down okay now we need to get out of brooks so we can come across no uh this way right 
uh, straight across, yeah, to here. And I think we can just bend our way up here and get out of the, uh, the mess. Okay. Okay, good. That gets us Brooks. And then we're heading down for Suffield, which is on the other side of the road. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we need to get over the, the road, which I think we can do here relatively easily at this point because we can just do this uh, there's the angle okay now we can work our way down Okay, we have that. We need to work our way up this way too. Yeah. This gets a lot easier when you don't have uh, a huge stack of uh, uh, blocking uh, obstacles in the way. You know, really, it gets easier without obstacles. Who knew? Yeah, that's... Um, that's an important thing, right? Uh, this sort of thing gets a lot easier when you don't have the uh, obstacles going on. Uh, right. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. We're... Uh... No, they need to be connected. Okay, and in we go to the connection. Okay, that gets us down to here. And then we need to get on into here, which uh, pretty sure we're going to do this. Um, yeah, we're going to do that straight out to here, and then we can bend our way up. Okay, and then we got to get across the uh, the road again, don't we? So we can do this. Yeah, we can do this. Okay, and we can just blast along here. Yep. So along like this, way up here. Um, okay, now we need to get this out here. Uh, yeah, okay, we can do that and that. There we go. There's that. Now we've got our, uh, our guy coming up this way. Okay, and we can come up this way. Yeah. Okay. Like this. Right. Yeah, we need to get all the way up here. All the way. Yeah. Okay. And we need to get across the, uh, the road and the... 
uh, river. Okay, so we'll do this. Yeah, we'll come across that way. That seems like a, a thing to do. And then I guess we need to get this out this way. Uh, kind of like this. Okay, that gets us down to Medicine Hat. Now, uh, we need to get across down to here. Well, it seems like we can just uh, uh, wind our way up this way. Yeah. Okay, now, um, yeah, we can uh, filter through this way in the uh, road allowance area here. Um, yeah. Okay, we need to come through here and... Okay, now we need, we'll go uh, under, and we'll connect up. Okay. And then we've got two more we just need to, to get to. Uh, and that's, uh, that's quick enough. Uh, we can come across along this way quite, uh, quite efficiently, I think. Uh, where is it? Yeah, it's over there. Uh, across this way, across this way. Uh, yeah. Okay, that's Irvine. And, and where did I put the Walsh one? Okay. Yeah, so here, I think we can crow fly across this, mostly. And then we're good. Yeah, so that's, um, that's the major uh, bits uh, roughed in. We got two and a quarter billion to build it, and then a fair bit more to fling some trains at it. Now, uh, next time around is when I'm going to fling the trains at it and, uh, and build it. And then we can uh, look at the, uh, uh, the layout in a little bit more uh, detail and maybe fling in some, some local trains in some, some places or something like that. Uh, but that's, um, that's kind of getting things, uh, things laid out. And uh, yeah, it's uh, quite a lot, uh, quite a, quite a lot of uh, relatively boring, uh, uh, you know, laying out tracks and all of that stuff for this game, and that's kind of why I'm uh, I'm going to give it a rest after this, uh, after next episode, uh, when I've accumulated enough cash to buy the 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 roughed in rails and put some trains on it, uh, and then. Uh, uh, afterward, we'll call the Alberta project at least phase one done, and then it'll be uh, some other project that we'll be looking at. Uh, and I also want to let the game develop a little further. Uh, the developer's active for quite active, and he's working towards some big things. So I want to see if um, some of those big things might mean that we come back and revisit the stuff we've done here. Uh, maybe allows us some more more advanced track laying and so on. Uh, now, uh, I'm not sure. I think I'm going to head southward uh, in the next uh, adventure. Uh, either way, I'm going to be looking at expanding outward from the existing network. 
Um, anyway, uh, that's going to be all for for this part. Uh, next part should be the final part of the Alberta uh, project or the you know, the the Alberta phase of the uh, the grand plan. Um, but anyway, uh, we'll see uh, next time. We'll do a little bit of looking at uh, the money and how the earnings going on and everything else once I've flung some trains at it. Uh, anyway, uh, that's, uh, that's going to be all for this time. So stay healthy. Don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. I mean, there does seem to be a light at the end of the tunnel after all. And, uh, you know, like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, whatever, or not. And see you back next time.